Okay, it is now time for another LP Classic Relog. I hope we're going to go a shorter one. Uh, for good news, we got Anthony out doing a Pokemon Go thing because of course he is. I ain't even got to play it yet. <laughs> so, he won't be bothering me. Ironically, I'm watching Pony earlier games for catching up with the recent episode. He liked to cut for playing how much like I did. So I can good. The new guy we agree on that. Um, but back on topic with a classic episode, Tradia, written by Scott Gunnaborn. So the plot of this one is that the main gig go to Rainbow Fall Trader Exchange, where we each actually brings off into three different plots. And what the, the main plot of the episode, Rainbow Dash wants to get the daring new book, but has to do all chain of deals in order to get to it. In the I can't even be playing it were. Rainbow Rarity and Abjack both want a thing and they can't decide which one they want to get because they both got pretty unreasonable to the other person. And the E plot, Twilight guide to you know, get way kind of a book, but Pink by think they can get way more for them because she a got pink guy. So the thing that definitely this one I out is like guy not usually go because even people like it aren't gonna be like Arr! And people hate it, it was, like, it, it's not the worst thing ever, um, go, but I could call the milk I can defend, even though I will met there's some weird thing. Go, go, think I could, the thing that definitely, I could probably, I could mention the fall, but the fall aren't too big, honestly, but they are kind of, with one, they're some, uh, moral issue in some way, with, you know, in some way, I mean, primarily with that scene, with, you know, Twilight kind of give away book away because it means quite a bit to her, blah, blah. Basically, a lot of people in Twitter gang, okay, to be a hoarder. That's probably not her intention at all, but I definitely how it came across. Well, it's a kind of a sweet moment. You know, showing how much my book means her. Definitely not going to be trash going to see up and go, <laughs> That can't be the only reason they put that in there. Like, it probably already came out that way. It would be funny if we foreshadowed it. I don't know. That that'd be great if that was the case, but probably against Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so But yeah yeah. And yeah, you know, the, the rarity thing got you know, anything turned out okay and I'll be bought, but there's some wonky stuff here and there. And of course that that infinite thing with him you know, that speaking scaling for shining to bravery. Let me explain that. Basically at the end of a whole, you know, ordeal, they have to give a two-headed dog, a double doggy, I can pick your pie, call it, come on, bro, double doggy, to a person, and the person like, oh, I think, like, a mess, I don't want it in my half anymore, but first I don't get me out of train to make it good, go, hey, first I, you come over to my place and you help me train this thing, but, even though, that's definitely not what anyone wants, but, when I say, get this offer because she really wants that book, you know, if you look at I mean, I did the, well, it is a problem in the sense that they did go a little far in a sense, but I don't, not probably a ton, because, one, Raymond Ash in the heat of the moment when she got the and she's not even really listening, and, and then once she realized what she done, she feel bad for it and tried to revert it. So, okay, I'm looking at a huge problem when they're going to keep for it, but it's a problem because it's kind of weird. But in terms of the location like, it's not... It's that I gay is that I really flavory. I mean, I think you know, I think it'd be okay if Flush actually would get that whole point. I think if Flush I would enjoy it, she enjoyed being the Warfrog. I don't think that would be too bad. You know? But at the same time, it's a little weird. And again, the bad one stuff get too bad. Awkwardly, if a free cock come up, because the one's morally the best. <laughs> and that kind of thing of a guy. All free epicogs are generally entertaining, like, I can enjoy them. But at the same time, they come with weird, clunky, moral or structure thing. <laughs> Do Punk and Dragon Street probably the one that works the best I got story, but also one that bothers the world slightly better. Well, okay, well, not in the moral line, but in terms of Luna and character I feel like they went too far to show a certain thing in the world. Thing. And it too, it both, you know, go all free up, I find it to be entertaining in the world, but I do have moral issues. But this one is more to bother me the least. Go with probably one I can get to. They could do one that like, you for me to enjoy, you know. To see if Tega Hikai High get way better, but the ending that kind of like, mm, more like I think it's fine in terms of what they intended. I'm gonna keep pushing that for that because they intended a good in the world. It's like, okay, it's a little characterization and what they do that like, kind of the problem. Like a character problem, not much of a moral problem. I think that some people, okay, quite frankly. 
Yeah, but look in trade, you can't come here with Google a little more deeply, but in trade, that problem again. You know, but look for him, but anyway, and of course, um, you know, um, I'll go completely dialed up and start a lot of bad explanation, but they got the start, you know, that come weird big later on, but that, you know, but this is a guy where I can look back on the problem, I think it's entertaining, not crazy though, but I, what I like about that the structure and three plot, that one plot, go, and each one has to do a trailer change, and it's a nice way to put the character on. They all like what could be a way they could structure ever up, because if they want to use a lot of characters, but without having to, you know, worry about putting time for each one. I don't mind them doing something kind of like this again at some point. But, um, you know, and I've even vote, yeah, like, the Neo Tupac aren't actually going to be applied, but they have a meeting moment. Uh, you know, but it's so fun to have free pop going on and it's and structure doesn't give that one edge and same value. Not crazy funny, but fun to watch some of the stuff go it's like entertaining up and watch because of both that happened again there are some good jokes like with Discord lamp. You know. Mm -hmm. You know. And uh yeah, cool thing with that too. But we just want to kind of fair you team local to entertaining element that kinda of keeps them afloat, you know. Um <laughs> Yeah, double from the cut. Yeah, double dog. Not double from the cut. Doggy actually kind of like a weird kind of cool position kind of thing with it. Look. But anyway, Kettigation could be a weird thing coming from that, but I pretty much what I primarily. Actually, for Kettigation, okay, Pea Pie and the rarity of one that will off occasionally. You know, you know, not too bad, but you know, it can be a little weird. Yeah, you know, because we have Frog on for structure and how entertaining you find it. The main stick of the Shandio thing. They could offer with it, but I don't know why I tend to like that plot. And it may cook again to retain the key what stuff can be traded, even though it's typical. It depends. It's a good fun plot to watch cook it. You can have done badly. Uh, well, you know, I can get plot done in uh, Ed and Eddie Shower. Shower had a song for it, but Fink and Ferg example did not. Weird. Uh, Fink and Campbell had that problem with the ending, which when I get to kidding that one, it'll be fun to talk about. But, you know, oh well, don't win the episode, but anyway. So, yeah, I don't know if they're gonna be I like that in any one. In the shower one, we could get had a song. For that, and then I kind of vaguely remember a song. Uh, that to look up, you know, but I'm done here. Um, but yeah, this kind of go we're primarily about a few couple things going on, and if you find a matrix and structure to be entertaining and interesting, then you enjoy the upcode. If you focus a bit more on the aspirin color interrogation at more you might have more problems with cup code and how it's more clunky. It, it didn't bother me too much, but it's enough to kind of make me like it slightly less. It's on the higher side of the kind of up code where, you know, my rating is decent for the point and couple wagon are both on the upper side of it to where I technically enjoy the basic app fusion. Very fancy cheap almost kind of color well, but not quite the extent. You know. Oh, I didn't mention for the government if I had something about Shirley. Yeah, way better than this one. Uh, but, uh, but way the moral and the plot and structure is just way better than that code. Yeah. You know, because he can create things that are pretty entertaining. But in terms of the moral, even when you have cool like this, which is simple and not complicated in the flight, can have a few problems. So, not sure. Again, well, actually, did you have cool again? I can look it up while I'm talking. Um, yeah, go. He had a good fun idea, but, you know, execution is not always going to be great. But, um, oh, there's a cheating map, which he did with someone, with King of Five, someone else. And I think we're no notification in that episode, even though it could have been, because he teamed up with someone else and then we'll provide you to, you know, I don't know. So team up with someone else if you're going to do the kind of thing again. Of course, we're not going to count the story behind the sheet, but they're probably going to go over it. Yeah, you don't want to catch them. Um, I'm okay with that. But, eh, they will come back, it'll do something really good, I don't know. It got to be entertaining, all three I don't mind watching. Well, it's not sure it's incredibly entertaining, it just had some funny moments. Of all the episodes, that one, I would definitely be willing to watch the least, because we're probably going me more of that one, and it's like entertaining, but it had its moments. We can make up for that kid, we can kind of entertain a value to them. It's just the writing there. They both can't have a problem with a time. 
you know, but, you know, we got more little other things, but they poke go maybe he'll pull a poke in the future, I don't know. But anyway, bear trade, yeah, nothing crazy, but for production stuff going for it'll go fun the episode, even if you have an article and what you think about it. You know, not only fair, but not only fair giver, it's decent, even if, and it's not will be most memorable, but that's fine, that everything's driving to be memorable, as long as you get done something different, I'm okay. That's all I got for the couple code. Again, I don't think it's bad computer game, but it's not one of my favorite gear. It's a fun little up code, but that's really about it. But hey, nothing wrong with that every once in a while. So, I kinda enjoy it, even though not a fair. Not quite guilty pleasure because I don't think it's bottom up too bad, but close. I think I'm gonna end uh, the review portion here now to pick up the next one very quickly. 87. That's this one with the fridge? That's for time that happened on here and it was the couple code. Get to do it again that tweet, no. Pick out another one. Seventy eight. Get Get away. I just mentioned that one. What the hell? Whoa, I just directly compared it to that one and took a how I feel about it and that next week. Whoa, creepy. But yeah, that should be a skip away. That should be an interesting one to talk about. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, what that? Oh, it's the. Oh, <laughs> Okay, then. I'll see you next week for skip away again. Thanks, guys, for judging a Discord. Since we're looking forward to And uh, at this point, probably won't be any other random. Well, again, I was thinking of doing some other, like, theory, but nah. I think next time we do vlog, but if not, this will be Penny Hero for Milo Murphy, which. Apparently, the theme song dropped today and they're supposed to be doing tomorrow, which means have an air date and it's probably gonna be October because that's where it's gonna be seen. So, and I don't know what next random issue we all go like the, um, you know, like, I don't know. Again, if I, if I can strike, you know, there's a couple things I could have totally talked about, like the Gumball up go with the anime people. They made by an actual anime studio, you know, I could have done that. But, um, oh well. Go. So, Either way, we'll go to Ring Book Board 2 that tweet. Keep away with Pete Dunning and Discord. So I really hope that one good, good, kind of awesome. Um, you know, so yeah, goodbye and uh, go back to you here. Goodbye.